This video is part of Florida's Technology and Learning Connection Project's Virtual Learning and New Training. This is the Switch Skills Progression Series hosted by Dr. Danilin Workentine. Welcome to Level 5, Introduced Choice, where we're learning how to use two switches. This is Level 5D, where we have one object and two actions. Let's take a look. We're going to utilize our Level 5 folder, and we're going to select Switch Kids. This time, we're going to select Build a Kid. I've already got my Bluetooth switch attached. And when I activate my switch, ooh, I'm getting something on the screen. Oh, maybe it's a head and ears. Oh, hair. What if I do this? Oh, it took the hair off. Oh my goodness. And with the magic of technology, we can see that we can build an entire person using our two switches. One switch moves us forward and one switch moves us back. So we have one object, the little build a kid guy that we're building, and our two switches cause two different actions. One progresses us forward and the other progresses us backward. On our level 5D, one object, two actions, we are able to see that a student can activate either switch to cause an event. One object experiences two different events with the two separate switches. The key feature at this level is that this helps students move beyond cause and effect and into a stage of thinking, experimenting, observing, and playing with objects. An example of a goal for level 5D, one object, two actions, might sound something like, the student can use two switches to affect one object. The student will note that one switch causes an object action, while the second switch causes the same object to react in a different way, noting the differing effects on X out of five opportunities. Funding for this service is provided by the Bureau of Exceptional Student Education, Florida Department of Education. The inclusion of technologies in this library and or described in this content should not be considered as an endorsement of any particular item or device. The instructional appropriateness of any of these technologies must be determined at the local level.